my name is Lucy. Um, I just thought I would do a quick vlog today. Um, I'm just off to go get a body scan. Uh, it can let you know your bone mineral density, your, mus uh, your lean muscle mass, uh, your body fat percentage, um, and a lot of other things that I'm sure I'll find out when I get there. They're doing a DEXA scan, I think it's called, um, is the short name for it. Uh, it stands for Dual Energy X-Ray something. I'm just going to put that down the bottom if anyone is interested in the full name. But it will be comparing uh, the DEXA scan, the bio scan and the skin fold. So um, the DEXA scan is supposed to be sort of like the premium gold standard of scanning your body. Um, so the skin fold is where they sort of have uh, clamps of some sort and they just pinch the side of your body uh, for body fat. I've never gotten one of those either, so that'll be interesting as well for me. So I'm going down to Griffith University. They're conducting the research down there where they're comparing all three methods. And I'm meeting with a lady called Ro. I follow her on Instagram. If you want to check her out, her handle is there. Um, what else can I tell you? My phone's frozen, like seriously. Yeah, it won't take more than 30 minutes to do all the three methods of a body scan. And I haven't been able to drink or eat just in the four hours leading up to the scan. So, um, yeah. So I'll see what I can film when we go there and um, see how it goes. Because I am a total amateur, my battery died right before I was about to get on the DEXA scan, which was the final one that I was doing, um, and probably the main one. So the first thing I got done was the skin fold test where Ro, the lady who did it, um, went through and marked my body, and then she then went through, pinched the fat, measured it with the clamps three times around, um, just to get an average number. The next one was I jumped on the scales, and it just read my body fat percentage and everything from there, which is not the most accurate, I know, because I always get different readings. Um, and the third one was the DEXA scan, which is considered to be the most accurate. So I had to lay down on my back um, for seven minutes and then basically just a, kind of just like a big bar just goes over the top of you, just x-rays your body, you just have to keep still. Um, and then that is where you get these results I will show you um, I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see it very well but I'll put it at the end of this video anyway if anyone's interested just to see what what comes on the scan what you get on the scan um, so here it shows your composition your body fat around your body so you can see that um, the greeny yellowy orangey areas are like the more percentage of fat so my arms which i know here my boot i know that on the sides 
but that's all good. So yeah, and then it goes through obviously your body fat percentage, your lean muscle mass percentage, your bone mineral density percentage, your BMI, um, height obviously, your overall weight. Um, and it's quite detailed even down the bottom. It's got uh, left arm, right arm, your left leg, right leg, and it goes through your percentage of your tissue, the grams of your tissue, and like the fat and your muscle in each leg and arm, etc. So um, it's quite cool. I like all this kind of stuff. So it was really good. Um, and yeah, it's given me some things to work towards. So yeah, I had heaps of fun going down there and checking it out and got some results back. So the results I got back were um, the scales that I jumped on ended up being, had me sitting on 28% body fat. Um, the skin fold test um, had me sitting on 24% body fat. And the DEXA scan has me sitting on 22% body fat which I suppose is considered um, the most accurate. So I will take that. <laughs> I will take that 22%. Um, and yeah. So sorry about not filming me laying on the thing, on the actual DEXA scan. You really didn't miss much. It is what it is. It happens. Thanks for watching. Anyways, hope you got something from it. And I might see you next time. I don't know.